Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. So we are in Bangkok for the weekend, um, cause it's a long weekend and we are on the hunt for the best mango sticky rice. Um, purely because we just love mango sticky rice and why not try and find it here? Um, so really keen to try and hunt down the best um, along our journey and just see what else there is to offer. So before we start the video, just quickly, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Um, and if you haven't already, please subscribe if you like the content. All right, let's go. So we are at our first mango sticky rice store. It's called Maybury. So M-A-E-V-A-R-E-E. -E. It's supposed to be the best mango sticky rice in Bangkok. Um, I have had it before, I will admit. So I can tell you that it is really good. But Alex hasn't had it before. He's going to be our... Here we go. The mango sticky rice is like 150 baht, which is kind of on the pricier end. So I think it's approximately five Australian dollars. Um, so it's, it's, I mean, it's not cheap, but it's really good, and they make it fresh every day. And they open from 6 a.m. to I think like 11 p.m. So it's pretty good. What do you like about it? The mango is very sweet and the rice has good texture and when combined with the mangoe bean it's really good crunch. Very nice. Very, okay. very nice. Is it the best you've had so far? Definitely the best I've had. Always good. Hello. We are in the car on route to Malawan Tea Thai, no, Thai Desert Shop. So it's a really old dessert shop. It's supposed to have some pretty good sticky rice. So we will check it out. Um, so we actually came to Malawan, but we asked them if they sold mango sticky rice and they don't, but apparently they do. So we bought these other Thai treats. So we bought this like pandan sticky kind of kueh. If anyone knows what kueh is, like very Malaysian vibe. And it's really nice. And we bought this, we bought just their sticky rice. So we'll just do a review of their, just their sticky rice, but no mango. But I mean, the sticky rice is probably pretty much the key thing in a mango sticky rice anyway, so. Right, this is the sticky rice. So it's like, it's the purple rice. So I think it's like a wild rice. And then it's got the coconut milk on top. Have at it, boy. Oh, it's not very sweet. It's nice. Very, very nice. The texture is perfect, actually. Okay. Now the connoisseur herself. Mm. Really nice. We have like bits of red bean in it, mm. I think, because red bean. And the rice is like really well cooked. It's like a little bit firm still. It's really nice. This place is like super small, but very unassumingly good. <laughs> so, we think that this is so good that you don't even really need the mango. Mm. So, I don't know, I would say that this is actually better than the rice that we had with yesterday's one. I think so as well. Yeah, but actually, but this is not like the sticky rice that I can eat with the mango. I think that the sticky rice yeah. the mango is a bit drier. Yeah. This one's a bit like more moist and warmer. So, I don't know if we can compare, but it's a different type of sticky rice, so it's good. So, we've found another mango sticky rice place in Chattachook Market. Um, Chattachook Market is like, this huge weekend market. Uh, it's got like everything. Like, it's kind of like the trash and treasure market. It's got accessories, clothes, food. The thing about this one is the uh, sweetness of the mango. Okay. It's so and soft. Made fresh. Very fresh. Very fresh. The mango is really nice. Really, really nice. The rice is like... It's 
7 out of 10. It's pretty good. But um, The mango is really good. But the mango is really nice as well. So we rate this one uh, a 7 and out a of half, 10. Maybe. Seven and a half out of ten. Yeah. So this place is called Hom Homgati, H O M G A T I, and it's near Gate no, Aisle Thirty Seven. We just went to go to Mango Tango, and it was heinous. I was trying to charge two hundred and twenty baht for sticky rice, mango sticky rice, which is just like the same as they serve everywhere else. Anyway, I made looked on reviews and it was like really poorly rated, so we didn't go. So I don't think you should go. So we just decided to um, try a local mango sticky rice place, just off the street randomly, just to be able to compare. Um, so we got this one. We're in um, Salam Deng. Are we in Salam Deng? Yes. Salam Deng. So we. Um, Bought one off the street and it was a hundred baht for a medium size and holy crap they give you so much and so generous. They gave us one and a half whole mango like one and a half mangoes and like all this sticky rice, which is crazy how much they gave us. Um, so relative to like I think price relative it's actually really cheap for how much they give you. So it was really really good. Okay, we're home now and this is the local mango. It just looks a bit bruised because I kind of bashed it around my bag, but we're good. It's nice. The mango is like good, but not as good as the one at the Charlie Chuck Market. Um, but the rice is nice. It's good. But I would give this like a, it's like a standard 6.57 out of 10. Like if I picked it up on the street, I'm pretty happy with it. So this sticky rice we have purchased from Central World Food Hall in Central World. I don't know why I just repeated that. Anyway, um, so we wanted to try a like food court kind of shopping mall. Rice. Um, so I think this one is smaller. It looks pretty good so far. The mango looks nice. So let's try it. This is our fifth and final mango sticky rice. The rice is nice. There's like a, I think it's pandani and the pandan is an original flavor. The mango is a little bit like, I think, I don't know, I think it's like the round mango and not the long mango. I think the long mango is better for mango sticky rice. But the round mango, is, it's just like a normal sweet. So it's not bad. I would give this like a 6, 6.5 between the two. So we are done. We have completed our mango sticky rice hunt. Um, I think that we are happy to say that Maverick was the best mango sticky rice place. Um, purely based on texture of rice and like the different flavors of the rice and also the mango. I think they, they really nailed like combining them two. Second best would be um, the one at Cheddar Shop Market. Um, third is probably the one today at Central World. Fourth is probably the street one. And the last one was like, because we didn't have a mango with it, so we can't really compare it. Um, but yeah, I would think that it was very good. I don't think there's a big margin between all of them. Um, so they price tickets, but I do think Maybury is probably like really worth trying if you're ever in Bangkok. Like you should try it every time. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it helped you figure out where the best place in Bangkok is to have mango sticky rice. Um, we definitely figured it out, so we're gonna stick to our good old Maybury. Thanks for watching.